What's up, everybody? We're back here on another adventure, and I'm over here checking Jennifer out for the famous Ninja Wings from the Ninja Air Fryer right here. That is super, super awesome device. <laughs> and then when Jennifer makes these wings, these are the bomb. They come out really, really, really nice, real tasty. Isn't that right, young lady? Yes. <laughs> so it is hot because we made one batch. Um, I like it. I like my Ninja. It cuts out a lot of time uh, for me to have to cook. I'm not slaving. And besides that, it's a lot healthier. So, you know, these days we're trying to do at least a little bit better um, every day. And the Ninja has been really helpful taking out like that ex excess fat. So we have fried chicken without me having to slave over the stove. So um, it's good, but I'm left-handed. So it doesn't always work out for left-handed people, um, but for over, you know, for the most part, it's really good. So this is the problem. See, lefty, and it opens to the left. So a number of times I've kind of had to really watch myself, and besides that, I'm short. So when it's sitting on the counter, it is kind of high. You have to kind of like do one of these. I don't know, but it's good. I like it. I like it. So. We're going to go ahead and put another batch in. I'm sorry, guys. I know I shouldn't be using no medical gloves, but I'm not trying to be all up on the chicken. I already marinated the chicken for like two days. And I also put olive oil in it. Um, so this is what my little bag looks like. And it's stuff like drum mats and stuff like that. So it's really good. I'm gonna take a plate, put it on here. It's really heavy. But we're gonna go ahead and move this out the way. And um, put this one here. And um, we're just gonna go ahead and place them in there. And like I said, I'm little, I'm short, so um, it's not so easy all the time. But see, you got little drumettes. <laughs> yeah, I got wings. And uh, so I stack it. I put as much as I can in there. Give it like one layer. You know, I'm sure you could do like all kinds of fancy stuff. I mean, I'm just not there yet. <laughs> I'm still exploring. It's still fairly new to me. Some people have had air fryers for years. Um, I haven't on the contrary so but I'm gonna try to fly away you know I try to be safe um, try to use my right hand but I feel awkward sometimes okay so you can see how it's stuffed in there oh yeah they and look delish I just go ahead and set on air crisp I'm gonna put it for 20 minutes and then what I do is I that gives me enough time to cook completely and I give it enough time to um, cook and then I flip and then I do like another five to six minutes because I like them brown on both ends and that's pretty much it anyway that's pretty much it so we're gonna wait for this bad boy to cook all those chickens sometimes you can hear it popping I don't get anything on me and I love it so this is the rest of our chicken and then I made potato salad so I made a big thing for a potato salad so um, and this is a topper it is not a hair, <laughs> hair for the hair <laughs> it's not it's not a bathing cap for the hair <laughs> Although that would be cute, and you can do that, I guess. But so we have that going on. It was yummy. Yes, and I don't know what else. We'll figure it out as we go along. But so far, and we'll show you those babies when they come out. And that's it. We'll right back. Talk amongst yourselves. A few moments later. It's done. So come over here. You'll hear it. Hopefully, I don't know. The microwave is going off. That's how those babies look. Now, I like to go ahead and flip them. You don't really have to because look how they come out. But I personally like to flip them 
because I like to brown them. Some of them stuck. Sometimes you could put like a little spray. Like I said, I put a little olive oil, nothing crazy. These babies are good. But like I said, I gotta be careful because I am short and I will burn myself if I'm not careful. Sure, I mean, I kind of do this to get it and bring it around, so I'm not touching that. But let's see if I could flip. Get them flip somehow. Ooh. <laughs> I can't. I can't. Like they're fighting. <laughs> I, I can't. <laughs> Wait, back up a little bit. I can't do it with you then. I'm not a righty, so this is awkward. This is really awkward. I don't know if anybody else has these issues. I do. Oh, come on. Flip. All right. I think that's about it. I think I flipped all of them. And then I put them back in. See, they're all looking like a little pale. So now I close it up. I'm gonna start that baby again and let's put it for like they came out like that with five minutes let's try um seven because i want them a little crisp a little crisp so all right here we go i gotta let my daughter cook some rice for herself so we yeah. out we'll see you in about seven minutes a few minutes later all right y'all so here come check this out they're a little bit crispier. Oops, sorry. My head's all up in the way. I think they came out like a little better. You got enough elbow room? Yeah, I got enough of them. Look at that. Yummy. And I'll just make little batches. I don't know how anybody turns this thing, but I just kind of hook it and turn. Doesn't mess it up or anything. But they came out nice. Look at that. Okay, I think that's it. And then, if you really look, it is taking out the extra fat out of the chicken. You see that yellow down there? Let me see if I can shake it, be careful. You see that? That's fat. So, we are eating healthier chicken using this. And I don't care what I'm gonna say. I know fried is good, fried is good, fried is good. But, I don't need to be popping. Having oil pop all over me. So, we're gonna do another layer. And we're gonna keep on going. That's right. <laughs> At least one hand. At least one hand. And then I just wipe down the, the front just to make sure, you know, nothing, uh, I know I got something on the floor. I'll wipe that down after. Everybody does their stuff different. The outcome is all the same. <laughs> Some good fried chicken. But this is like the healthier version. And then I only have like one more left to do. And that's it. So this will be my small little batch here. And I'll just kind of like fold that down because I don't really want to touch that too much. And we got another beautiful layer there. And we're going to get this baby started. Oh, yeah. Yep. And that's pretty much it. And then I'll just do this for however long I got to do it. Let me put it for 20. And then that's already starting. And that's it. Look how beautiful they're coming out. And then we'll try them at the end. So, I gotta let my daughter continue cooking her rice. So, we'll come back. 20 minutes later. So, I'm on the last batch. No big deal. Um, so far, this is how much I've made. Um, I'm gonna have one of the boys, I'm gonna call one of the boys to come over here because he was dying to have a piece. All I did was use two seasonings. I used Badia Complete and a little bit of garlic. Uh, David, why don't you come over here so you could try some? 
all the way. Oh, well, I paid up later. It's um, oh, look at that. Steaming. It is cooked all the way. Look at that. Steaming hot. And the skin is crispy. And guys, this is good. Two seasoning. That's it. With the air fryer. That's it. So we're going to enjoy dinner. Peace out, y'all.